Hello, welcome to another X3D Road tutorial. In this class, we're going to see how to insert transparent images of trees, plants, people, and vectors inside AutoCAD. The system I'm using here requires that you have the normal and opacity map of the image. While it is possible to insert PNG transparent images inside AutoCAD directly using the command image, I don't recommend this way to insert images if you are working in 3D. So, if you don't have the normal and opacity map of the image, take a look at x3droad.com slash psp1a. In this page, you're going to find a tutorial teaching the correct way to get the normal and opacity map of an image. Ok, let's start with this tutorial. Click in the view controls and select SW Isometric. In the ribbon, click on the surface tab and click in Planar. Click here and then click over here to finish the command. Click in the Visualize tab in Materials section and click in the Materials Browser icon. Right click, duplicate, give it the name My Tree 1. Enter. Now, in this material, right click, edit, wait for the material to load, click in the white rectangle on the generic, and select the image with the white background, the normal map. Activate cutouts and select the image with the black background, the opacity map. Close the material. Select and drag this material to the plane, as shown. Close the materials browser. In the visual style controls, select realistic. If you don't see the material yet, you need to modify the material. But, first of all, we need to rotate this plane. Click on the plane to select it. In the Home tab, in the Modify section, find the 3D Rotate icon and click on it. In the 3D Gizmo, click in this axis and type 90 and then Enter. Press Escape to finish the command. In the Visualize tab, Open the Materials Browser. Select the material, right click, edit, click in the normal image, scroll down, and in the repeat section, select none in both boxes. In the scale section, find the correct dimensions for the image. Do exactly the same in the opacity map. Close, close, and close. Let's rotate this tree 180 degrees. And let's move it up. Ok, this is the correct way to insert transparent images inside AutoCAD. See you guys later. Bye.